Imagine if the glue that holds your entire body together malfunctions. I have Ehlers-Danlos Syndrome. It's a connective tissue disorder that affects the structure of the collagen. Collagen literally holds everything together in your body, like your joints, your muscles, your organs, etc. Every person with Ehlers-Danlos is affected differently, so you can't really compare two people with Ehlers-Danlos. It's super frustrating to see some people online generalize EDS to the extent that people start to believe that EDS is only certain things and that's it. So I have a lot of conditions related to or caused by Ehlers-Danlos and just random conditions. One of the things is that I rely on tubes to receive most of my nutrients. I have been on tube feeds before that failed. I was also on TPN, which is IV nutrition through a medical device that I have implanted on my chest, which failed after a few months as it just couldn't provide my body with enough either. I was recently started on tube feeds again and I had a surgical feeding tube placed in my abdomen and into my small intestine. Every single aspect of my life is greatly impacted by my conditions and every single system and organ in my body is affected. Part of the GI side of things that I deal with is that I don't produce enough of the enzymes to break down most foods and also inflammation contributes to my malabsorption issues. So of course with that I had to take a lot of supplements, vitamins, and medications just to keep me somewhat comfortable. Even then, my baseline chronic pain all over my body is pretty severe. Um, I know sometimes it can be hard to understand something that you can't see. Uh, I hope this gives a bit of perspective into how people can be affected and you learn something new.